If you've had your eye on a Dell laptop, they've been in the computer game for a long time, and their roster of products is huge. But because their choices are so vast and varied, it can be very confusing to narrow down which model will work best for your situation. In this video, we're breaking down the best three Dell laptops in the market this year, based on price, performance, features, and situations they'll be used in. We'll be taking a look at Dell laptops in every price range, so whether you're looking for the best budget Dell laptop, or a workstation laptop that can handle your workflow, we'll have an option for you. So if you're interested in finding out which laptop will be best for you, stay tuned. As always, all the links to find the best prices on all the products mentioned in this video will be in the description below. So for the most up-to-date information, along with updated prices, be sure to check out the description. The products mentioned in this video are in no exact order, so be sure to stay tuned till the end so you don't miss anything. We'll start by looking at the Dell Inspiron 15, our choice for best budget Dell laptop. The Dell Inspiron 15 is a great choice if you're on a budget, and it offers a variety of features and will satisfy most budget mainstream users. But most importantly, it comes at a price point that's less than $600 and presents excellent value for your buck. The Inspiron 15 uses an Intel 10th Gen Core i3 processor, Intel UHD graphics, 8GB of DDR4 RAM, which is more than sufficient in running higher-end applications without hiccups. And for storage, you get a 1TB HDD and a 128GB SSD. For connectivity, you get one USB 3.0 port, one USB 2.0 Type-A port, two USB 3.1 Type-A ports, and one HDMI port, an SD card reader, an RJ45 jack, and a headphone jack. And when it comes to battery life, the Dell Inspiron 15 proved itself pretty impressive. You can expect to get about six and a half hours of uptime, which is pretty good for a budget laptop. On the exterior, it features an all-black case that looks simple and clean. You get a 15.6-inch 1366x768 HD resolution touchscreen display, which may not be as vibrant as some others, but is more than sufficient for surfing, word processing, or daily use for general productivity, and is especially perfect if you're a student on a budget. However, if you're looking to color correct a bunch of photos in Lightroom, or to do color accurate editing work, the new Dell XPS 13 coming up next may be more up your alley. The keyboard on the Inspiron 15 is a bit stiff, and offers 1.3mm of travel time, which you may not find completely comfortable. But to make up for it, it has palm rests which are incredibly soft and comfortable. And if you use Microsoft Office programs, you'll be thrilled to know that the Inspiron 15 features a full numeric keypad on the right side of the keyboard, which many laptops at this price point don't offer. The touchpad gives you a satisfying response and is big enough to offer room for multi-touch gestures and scores high on accuracy. The audio is okay for voice and some music, but on the whole, mids can be a bit muddy and bass is practically non-existent, but that's to be expected at this price point. Some improvements can be made using the Dell's audio software to calibrate the speakers, or by selecting a particular sound profile. The Dell Inspiron 15 is extremely well priced and offers very decent performance. You'd be hard pressed to find better quality at this price point. If you're a student on a budget or looking for a cheap, multi-purpose, daily-use Dell laptop, then look no further than the Inspiron 15. Now we'll be taking a look at the new Dell XPS 13, our choice for best overall Dell laptop. If you're looking for the best overall laptop that Dell has to offer, then take a look at the new Dell XPS 13. At around $1,650, this laptop has plenty of power to handle both productivity and creativity, and strikes a nice balance between price, performance, and features. The new Dell XPS 13 screams precision. Even its chassis is sculpted using CNC machining and results in an elegant design with high build quality that's stronger and stiffer than magnesium or plastic. Not only is this laptop extremely lightweight at 2.8 pounds, it's super thin too, measuring in at just over a half an inch at its thickest point. There's very little in the way of wasted space here, as the keyboard extends nearly to both edges of the laptop, along with a healthy sized and incredibly smooth touchpad. The keyboard is a winner and provides you with key travel that is just deep enough to be comfy. For connectivity, you get two Thunderbolt 3 ports, a micro SD, and a headphone jack. That's it. That's admittedly more than many other laptops on the market right now, and there's not really any space on the laptop for more. It just means you'll have to live that adapter life, but the trade-off for a small and lightweight chassis is worth the trade-off. Under the hood, the XPS 13 is rocking an Intel Core i7 processor, Intel Iris Plus graphics, 16GB of onboard RAM, and for storage, a 512GB SSD. Its 13.4-inch FHD Plus Infinity Edge Touch anti-reflective display is a thing of beauty. At 500 nits, it's one of the brightest, most colorful displays you'll find. The same can't be said for the speakers, though, which are located on the bottom of the laptop. They're pretty decent for watching a quick YouTube video or binging some Netflix in the middle of the night, 
but if you want to really enjoy your media, the speakers aren't going to cut it, and you'll probably want to get some external speakers. In terms of battery life, the XPS 13 delivers big, lasting over 9 hours on average. But your results might vary depending on how much stress you put on it. But it's safe to say that this laptop can get you through the workday and still have enough juice to let you chill and watch some Netflix on the train home. The new XPS 13 is one of the best laptops that Dell has to offer and is a versatile all-rounder laptop that is capable of handling your workload, is extremely lightweight, and portable. Now we'll be taking a look at the new Dell Precision 5550, our choice for best Dell workstation laptop. If you need a powerful workstation laptop that can handle intensive tasks like CAD, 3D modeling, and computer graphics rendering, at around $2,500, the new Dell Precision 5550 mobile workstation is a top choice that will get the job done. The new Dell Precision 5550 is a small, thin, 15-inch mobile workstation that features a 15.6-inch, non-touch, ultra-sharp FHD Plus IGZO 4 display with 1920x1200 resolution, anti-glare treatment, and 100% sRGB for good color accuracy and up to 500 nits of brightness. Its backlit keyboard features a modern look and feel and is a pleasure to use, and you'll like the large touchpad that offers smooth, accurate operation. Under the hood, the Precision 5550 comes with an Intel Core i7 processor, 16GB of onboard DDR RAM, and 512GB SSD for storage. You'll get stunning graphics when working with applications like Adobe Creative Cloud Suite thanks to the impressive performance of its NVIDIA Quadro T1000 graphics. And there's plenty of ports too. You'll find a USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C port, USB 3.1 Gen 2 Type-C port with Thunderbolt 3 for power delivery, a USB 3.2 Gen 2 Type-C port with Thunderbolt 3, an SD card slot, a universal audio port, and a lock slot. The Precision 5550 features the Dell Optimizer, an automated AI-based optimization technology that learns how you work and adapts to your behavior. It's designed to improve overall application performance and to handle your demanding workloads, like graphics processing, data analysis, and CAD modeling. With a smaller footprint and thermal innovations, the new Precision Mobile Workstation gives you increased performance and ISV certifications with professional graphics and the latest Intel Core processors. The battery is a 6-cell, 86-watt-hour lithium-ion battery with express charge. AI improves battery performance by adapting to your typical power consumption and charge patterns. If you're always on the go, you can use the Express Charge Boost to gain 35% charge in about 20 minutes. But if you have more time, Express Charge will automatically get you up to 80% in an hour. If the charge in the battery is decreasing and you can't charge your system right away, the AI will subtly adjust settings to preserve resources, like dimming your screen or turning off Bluetooth when you're not using it. If you're a creative that needs a lot of power to get the job done, the Dell Precision 5550 will have your back and should be top on your list. Alright guys, that's all for now. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you like the video, consider subscribing. We do our best to keep you up to date with the best products on the market right now. So if you want to stay current regarding the best gear, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most up-to-date pricing on all the products mentioned in this video. Hope you all have a great day, and we'll see you back here soon for the next video.